completely outside the position of floral parts on the thalamus. The arrangement of floral parts on the thalamus varies in various flowers. Flowers are divided into different groups on the basis of position of gynesium on the thalamus in relation to other floral parts. Hypogynous flower. The gynesium is present at the tip of the thalamus. The remaining floral parts like calyx, corolla, and racium are arranged at the base of the gynesium. In this flower, ovary is positioned completely outside the thalamus. So, it is called superior ovary. Examples, hibiscus, datura. Perigynous flowers. The gynesium is located centrally in the thalamus. The remaining floral parts like calyx, corolla, and dresium are arranged along the margins. In this flower, ovary is present partly inside and partly outside the thalamus. So, the ovary is called half inferior and half superior ovary. Example, tephrosia. Epigynous flowers. The ovary of the gynesium is completely embedded in the thalamus. The wall of the ovary is completely fused with thalamus. The remaining floral parts like calyx, corolla, and andresium are arranged along the margins of the thalamus. The ovary is completely inside the thalamus. So, the ovary is called inferior ovary. Example, tridax.